Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages one of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world and so the national anthems And we rise now for the Danish national anthem. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Yeah, Peter, you can look at this formation one minute and think that it is 4-3-3, and the next time you check, it'll be 4-5-1. And it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not, and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. So it's down to business here. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Well, a man with incredible energy levels, David Alaba. Always advancing, but he's diligent in his passing and, and crosses with care. He can also smack an effort to go with that left foot. And um, he's very solid in his defensive work too. So yeah, have a look out for him. I'm thinking the same. He will be a central feature, no doubt. Lovely feet. John boots it to safety. Balls loose. Who's getting there? And it's Baumgart Klinger. Delaney. It is early, but the game hasn't yet sparked into life. Got a size of goal here. Has a swing at it! And that really should have hit the net. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Into Rega. Forward it goes. on it should up Ericsson lovely bit of skill there into the middle and it's hoisted clear and he's there to cut it out and the ball's come out match or thereabouts gone and we still await the first goal just brushed off the ball there great run on the overlap here 
Receives it from behind. Looking for a decent ball in. Now the cross. And they plays it forward. Plays it out to the wing. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. And it's Bergstahler. He's in! Can he finish? Goal! Austria! And it's Austria who go ahead. Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Austria take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. That intervention was very necessary. Is it out of harm's way? And it's Bergstahler. Room for us as a pop! A oh, terrific run to latch onto it, but the finish is all wrong. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Just whacks it away. And it's Schoen. Well, Neltovic. Down Bartlinger. Well, Neltovic. And we hit half-time. Well, there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. And we're underway again. Denmark don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Bergstahler, and he's onside. Delaney tries to get it forward quickly. Eriksson. Christensen. He's got away. To the left it goes. Has a shot! A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Out towards the flank. Deftly done. Boots it to safety. Crosses in a low one. Big chance! Could fall kindly. Big relief in. Just needed better contact. Well, he was so quick to respond to that. Almost made it count. Great opportunity. Down guard, Linger. So, Jim, what are you thinking? They may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. 
found Bartlinger. Kiar. I think the substitutions will be coming up pretty soon. Aimed long and direct. There are a few waiting for it. The clearance and very necessary. And it's been taken straight back. Schoener. Drives it in. Towering header. Really well taken goal. Denmark back on level terms. Denmark are so well practiced in the art of keeping the ball through wonderful passing and movement and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. Denmark grab the equaliser and we're all square. It's pulsating, it's absorbing and it's hugely entertaining. Every single player is giving everything. Alaba. Baumgart Linga. Concentration levels are very good and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. He's through. Denmark showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. He's made certain that won't get through. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. And the flag has stayed down. Denmark merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Alaba takes a look up, looks to thread it through. Managed to get it away. And time is up. Well, nobody is totally satisfied, but it was a, a more than decent game, a super watch. And it ends in a draw. Your reflections then, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might...